Hey everybody, HMV here. Playing more Into the Breach and Disconnected Soul, Broadplank, and Chen Rong, who is actually Blackout, who's on call, <laughs> uh, called out. Uh, we picked up Smoke Drop, we picked up a Light Tank, and uh, we still have the, the standard Prime Harpoon for, for um, Disconnected Soul's mech. Uh, we are hurting on Power Grid, but um, I'm a little confident because we picked up that tank. So we're going to head into Pinnacle, and we're going to see if we can avoid losing here and we are going to probably prioritize um grid power defend the robots not uh not that hard let's go ahead and take it and see how we do uh the only upgrade we have other than this tank and the smoke is um this guy uh if you look at it here uh if he kicks off of a building, he does extra damage, so that's going to be nice. Um, but his first turn, he's going to be he's going to be tossing that tank out because that's that's what you do. <clears throat> okay, we got our time pod right away, which is always nice. Uh, hopefully, we'll freeze some guys. Throws one of them. That's nice. Uh, sadly, if we want to dunk this guy with the uh, with your power, we're going to have to um, we're going to have to shoot here. Uh, we could instead dunk this guy, but that'll knock this guy into him, which is, I'm going to say, bad. Uh, we could do this, which will take care of this guy, and do one damage to him. Um, first, though, we could come here, toss our tank out. Tank comes here, does one damage to him, so that this will kill him. Then I think we're going to have to do this. Oh, no, we can't do that because that'll hurt him. That'll send you there. So I guess it's smoke time. Uh, let's go ahead and actually move you back here. And we'll plop some smoke down right there. That seems like a good spot to drop smoke. Um, and then, oh, yeah, you get one free move movement. Not that it really matters all that much. Probably didn't even want to do that. That makes me kind of happy, but this guy makes that less than ideal. Uh, we can very quickly fix that by doing this, and I think we're going to. Take care of you. Um, you can't quite get where you want to go. I think we're going to move you back there. Um, you can get here, so go ahead and do it. You could get here, but I kind of like that it's... Uh, That it's on fire, so we're going to do that, and then you are going to not do anything because you don't actually have a good move. So let's just plop you right here. And then we sit. And okay, the healing guy's on fire, which is good by me. So we can knock this guy in the water again by shooting him, though. Oh, no, the other way around, actually. That's even better, because we can do this. Although, that'll freeze you. So you come over here and repair yourself. Then you do this. He's dead. Uh, can't do anything else cool. So let's go ahead and damage this square. None of these guys, none of these guys are actually hurting, so I'm just going to let that go. And, uh, yeah, come back out there. Why not? Final turn. We got one bad guy. And he's frozen. So, we'll just end the, <laughs> the round. <laughs> I hope they all go this well. That tank, uh, that extra tank really makes a difference in, uh, how quickly, um, you can take over the, the board here. Uh, we picked up another dude. He gains flying, which I'm not going to complain about, that's for sure. Um, and you got a mech reactor, and you got a mech reactor. Wow. Everybody gets a mech reactor. That actually means, though, that you are not going on a squad, buddy. Um, yeah, the outer damage kind of scares me on this guy. Um, makes me wonder if I should move the tank to you and start doing an upgrade tree on that. But you can't quite do it yet. Um... Because that would allow you to get the extra kick damage, which is awesome. Um, if we give it to you, you can get extra range, which is also very nice. Cool. 
Yeah. Uh. Or we could just upgrade the tank. We could just work on that tank. Yeah, let's work on the tank. Okay, you get that. Um, actually, let's do... Not that it really matters that much right now, but let's do that. And then... Uh, I guess we'll give you move. Oh, you have a power available. Well, we'll give you move as well. Okay, moving on. Uh, kill seven enemies and protect the coal plant. Sounds good to me. Uh, he's three. He's three. I don't like that at all. I'll switch you there, you there, and you there. That's annoying. Although that's nice, because this will free you from the ice. So let's go ahead and accept that as a thing. Toss your tank here. Uh, yeah, that works. And then that'll kill him. And then that just leaves you, which we can't actually do very much to. So we will do this instead, which will block a spawn. That's good. Probably didn't want to move her up, but oh well. I've right, only killed one enemy so far, which is something you got to pay attention to in this. Uh, the obvious guy to kill is you. Um, we need to shoot here, so go here. And shoot here, that'll kill him. Uh... I would love to kill one of these guys, but that's not going to happen. Uh, if you kick off of here, you can kill him like this, and I think that's worth it. Yeah. Not a huge fan of that. Um, and I think having this guy frozen is a good idea. So let's unfreeze this guy so we have a chance of uh, killing seven enemies. But, yeah, we basically aren't going to get this. Okay, he goes first. This You're just going to refreeze, which sucks. Um, well, we could do this at least. And you can pull him into here at least, so he's no longer a problem. And then... And none of these make any sense. Um, you could actually do this, might as well. It's dumb, but we're going to do it anyway. Yeah, because all three of us are going to be frozen now. <laughs> but so is the objective, so... We're not going to be in any actual danger. Actually, I guess you're not going to be frozen. And the question is, can you kill anybody? And the answer is, you can't kill him. So the only guy you can kill is him, so go ahead and do it. And then we'll just, you guys chill out. We, we were able to kill five enemies, but just... We're not quite strong enough yet to kill seven on a map where half of them freeze over turn. But we got the we got the lightning bolt, which is what kind of what we were going for. Um, reclaim the district, huh? That's a scary one because no buildings can take any damage whatsoever. Um, let's go ahead and protect the emergency batteries. Let's be cheesy about it. Um, you there, you there, you there. Okay, so far not super scared. Uh, there's no way to get this guy in this water, or is there? Yeah, there is. We can do that. And Matt, you should have tossed your tank out. That's enough of a mistake that I'm actually going to redo it. And then you are just going to murder this guy. And I guess we'll move you over one. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, what can we do here? Clever. Not a darn thing. We can do this. Oh no, we want the opposite. We want this. Hmm. Trying to figure out a way to kill this guy. You can't get over there. You could go up here and shoot him this way. And then when you shoot here, it'll knock him in there. There we go. That's the way you do it. Playing the guitar on the MTV. Oh, no, that's, no, that's not the way you do it. You're not playing the guitar on the MTV. Okay, we're going around the rosy. And you can murder this guy. Or not. I forget that you don't have damage on yet. Uh, so we'll just uh, do that. And actually leave you there. I like you there better. Okay, we're gonna start. Oh, you're not the tank. Dang you. Okay, use that building jump. Uh, you. Gonna do that. And you are gonna do that. And then you are gonna do that. So now I got one guy left on the last turn. And he's very easy to kill. Okay, I'm feeling a lot better about the grid defense now. Um, I would love to pick up these three, and I think I'm going to try. I think I'm going to try. Do or do not. It only works if you try. I don't know how, I don't know how that phrase goes, but something like that. Okay, these guys are scary. And only partially because they can totally destroy everything. Um, smoke here seems like a really good idea. Uh, you plot the tank there and shoot this guy this way, or this guy this way, but it's not going to kill this guy, so they'll still damage the buildings, which we have to avoid at all costs. Um, you do a building kickoff on him to do extra damage to him. Let's see. You could do this, which will pull him out of the way. Yeah, let's do this. Then you toss your tank there to shoot him out of the way. And you go here. And I think we're just going to drop some protective smoke here. I don't like that little square there. And you could move, uh, and you know what, let's move here. A lot of bad guys. Only one is attacking a building, which I think is very nice of him. Uh, we're gonna kick off a U into you. And now he is shooting his buddy. Uh, we can't actually hurt these guys. So I think we're going to do a damage to you. We're going to push him back, and you are going to shoot him, and then move back one. Yeah, these armored guys, when you, when you don't have very many hit points, are terrible. Um, we can't take a hit from either of these guys, so he might just run off this way. Although if he does this, he'll push him. He'll push them both away, won't he? 
So that is smart, actually. Yeah, actually, this is very smart. And then you can do that. Push it there. Now he'll hit him. We need to kill this guy. Or push him away from the building. I hate to do it, but we're going to push him away from the building. Now you are still annoying. We got one more turn. Uh, oh, you have a you have a one move. I think we're going to move you back this way. That was dumb. He's going to bump into you. He soon kill you. Therefore, it made you stronger. Okay. Two big threats. Not a big threat, because he's going to run in the water if we get out of his way. So we got three big threats. Uh, and this guy's making that very difficult to deal with. And this guy's also a problem. So we got four big threats. Yikes. Okay. Wish I still had that smoke. Because if you shoot here... It gets everybody out of the way, but it damages the building. So that's bad. Um, nobody else can get over here. So it looks like we might have lost this one. We can push you out of the way, but that doesn't actually push you out of the way. We can push you out of the way, so only he's doing the damage. If we could do two damage to this guy, which we can... But he's doing, yeah, he's doing a ton of damage to him, so that'll that'll kill him. Okay, we're gonna do this. We're gonna shoot at him. You're gonna do this. Now he's dead. And you're dead too. But I think we don't have a choice at this moment. And then you're going to do this, and we require a 15% chance to happen <laughs> in order to get all of these things. And we're still going to lose a dude. And our 15% chance didn't happen. This is it for me, Broadplank. Sorry. You the died. But hey, guess what? Now you're an awesome robot. Who doesn't want to be a robot? You like shoot laser beams out your eyes and stuff. It's awesome. Okay. Destroy the leader of the Firefly, Malcolm Reynolds. You gotta kill Malcolm Reynolds. How dare you? Okay. They don't like this building at all. Let's see. We can be moderately clever here. Annoyingly, that doesn't kill him. But this will. No, it won't, because I'm using the wrong mech. Oh, that'll kill him. We'll let, but he doesn't go first, of course. So do that, and we'll just deal with the fact that we're not actually hurting anybody. That's cool. You just killed your buddy. And actually we're going to do this, which will kill both of these guys. Actually, amusingly, I think I'm going to do this, which will kill him, so that you can do this. And then you can do this. Definitely have to uh, address the Firefly Leader this turn. Of course, he set himself up so we can't address him. Uh, 
you've got nothing you can do. Is it worth doing one damage? I think it is. As crazy as that sounds. <clears throat> I suspect we're not going to kill the Firefly Leader. But who knows? Yeah, he's going to do four damage, which isn't going to kill this guy. Then he's going to do three damage to him. So if we can do one damage to him, we kill him. Which is pretty freaking simple. So let's do that. And we don't really need to kill you, so just get you out of the way. I would love you to be right there. So he dies too. And then we're done. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, we got seven wrap. I would love two more. Could get two more. Um, you could also pick up this, which is amusing because it look, looks the same as this. But uh, I hate to say it, but I think we're going to do this. I'm feeling the crunch. I don't know, 100% sure that's worth it, but we're going to do it anyway. Okay, um, yeah, we're going we're gonna to leave it here. We are two islands in. We are looking a lot better. Um, I think we're still going to go for the four island victory, which means um, we're going to Pinnacle next, and we're going to see how we do there. I hope you're looking forward to it. I'm definitely looking forward to doing it. I'm HMV, and I will, as always, talk at you later.